So here are the must-watch videos from the Winksound.com community. That's right, these videos come straight from our members. They've uploaded them to the site, and you can too. Build your free profile right now on Winksound.com and start uploading your videos and sharing your knowledge with our community right away. 808 Remix 1 goes over the basics of editing MIDI notes using the piano roll in Ableton Live. And now as we edit, we can hear these changes. Now again, to get to these parameters, we need to be in the clip box to enable the ability to see notes, MIDI notes. Here we see all the MIDI note parameters here. Now this is kind of tight down here. This is a great place to bring your mouse up, get it in between these two panels, click and hold, and push upward. And we can use all this we want to. Now it's more easy to tell this is a piano keyboard down the side. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. We see also the two black keys, three black keys, two black keys, three black keys going down the left. Now notice as I move my mouse around on the grid over to the gray area in the left here next to the piano it's telling me exactly what note that might be. Let's listen to this clip now by clicking on its launch button here. Third stop explains how to chop samples using the NNXT sampler in Reason. Go to load sample. I'm just going to load a random sample. You can either take this line here and move it around till you get what you want. Or you can just go to these high low key. I want to set the high key at C3 and the low key at C3. So what I'm going to do is copy this. Move it over 